welcome to an universe double two today we will discuss about what is the difference between solid liquid and gas and second point what is the fluid and in last we will discuss about what is the flow the difference among solid liquid and gas are given below first one is solid solid has definite shape and volume and in case of solid the molecules of a solid are bonded together with high degree of force that is cohesion which give them a rigid and compact form and solids are incompressible in nature and here iron and stone these are some examples of solid so one thing is clear here the shape and volume this remains fixed in case of solid next is liquid liquid has definite volume but the shape or size changes according to the shape of the container as we can see in this figure the liquid can change its shape according to the shape of the container in both the cases the molecules are bonded together with low degree of force that is a cohesion so firstly what is the meaning of cohesion cohesion is the property of a liquid by which molecules of same liquid attract each other that is called cohesion and therefore liquid can easily acquire the shape of the container in which it is placed and liquids are also incompressible in nature water mercury petrol diesel etc these are some examples of liquid now what is a gas gas is different from liquid and solid it has no fixed volume and shape both volume and shape changes it expands continuously to fill the container in which it is placed and the intramolecular attraction is practically absent in case of gases consequently the gases molecules have a greater freedom of movement even inside the container in which gas is kept and gases are compressible in nature and air carbon dioxide carbon monoxide these are some example of gases now what is a fluid matter exists basically in three state solid liquid and gas and fluid is the common name given to the liquid and gas and here solid can resist tensile compressive and shear stresses and solid resist forces which tend to deform up to elastic limit it regain its shape and size when load is removed so this is possible up to the elastic limit after elastic limit deformation will takes place in case of solid now what is a fluid fluid is a substance that deforms continuously when an external shear force is applied on it here shear force is important because due to the application of shear force deformation takes place in case of liquid and continuous deformation of fluid does not stop until the force is removed and in other words fluid is a substance which offers no resistance to shear deformation and the continuous deformation of a substance of a fluid is known as flow So, so today we have learnt about difference between solid liquid and gas and what is a fluid and what is a flow so here in this video if you like this video you share it among your friends and students you can ask your queries by commenting thanks for watching have a nice day